It's funny, I like traveled all over the place this year, but my best videos are the ones that we make like on the beach, at home. Do you guys see the mountains? See the snow up there? Ooh, and this beach over there, now I gotta get over there. The only way I could do that is to come from the other side. There's the eagle. But you know what, if I don't work tomorrow... Mm, no, I shouldn't even say that. I shouldn't even say that because I don't have any bear spray. I'm out of bear spray. And there's a big bear wandering around. Big bear, no spray. Hmm. I know, that makes me sad, but I really want to get over there. I shouldn't let fear stop me, right? But, I don't know, sometimes it's like not fear, and sometimes it's just like common sense. There's a lot of bears right now looking for like stuff to eat, right? I'm just looking for my quartz rock. I'm like missing. I probably smashed the part now in a million pieces. God, that was a big ball. And I can't believe if it just waited a bit longer, I could have gotten it home. Well, I shouldn't say that. It would have been a big production to get it home, actually. It would have taken like three of my friends to lift it and carry it, I'm sure. Carry it out of there. So, hey. All right, so we're not talking about nerds. Yeah, thanks, fans. We're at 3,441 subscribers today because I was working on it. Because I was working on it this morning. That's the thing. If you want to be a YouTube star, you got to really work on it. And although I'm going to say, I don't like have a lot of interesting things to say every day, but. I don't know. People watch. Whoa. Whoa, whoa, whoa. People watch my videos because I go outside lots. Look at this. Man, that's pretty. Look at the lines on that. I always find these in green, but I don't find a lot of them in blue. Hmm. Hmm. This too. What is this? Hmm. Very cool. Shine that up. That would be very cool. Um, I don't have a tumbler, but I do like resin. You can resin some of these rocks. I know it's always a good spot in between the rocks here. So New Satsum's got a lot of garnet. Usually when I come down in this area, that's what I'm kind of looking for, is like a granulate ball with some red on the outside. So like, oh, look at this. Smash part. I think there were some people here yesterday. Smashing rocks apart. Um, a granulate ball, like something like this. But this one does not. See how it doesn't have any red on it? Well, it does a tiny, tiny, tiny little bit right here, those tiny little red specks. That'll make garnets if it's given mm, enough space to grow a garnet. So, I have found some nice garnets here. And some nice green granite. Uh, it's just nice to take a break from chores. I'm doing a lot of chores. Or something like um, yeah. <laughs> something like this maybe big peg in the ground around here nice color this guy this guy is interesting it's not a brand new ball but it's got that cool red this thing. what'd you say Sour Patch, what? 
These are cool. This green basalt with quartz left in it. This is cool. This looks like somebody busted it apart. Or it was busted apart by the force of the water. Like I was saying, the water was just up. It was up high. I like these too. I did bring my hammer and my chisel, so I could bust a couple more things apart. This. Beautiful. I got some more of this material at home, fresh off the mountain. Oh, better looking than better looking than all the little pieces I could find here. But here's a piece of quilt from farther up. I know where you came from. These take these home and fresh these up any day of the week. Get all that sulfide locked in there. I might actually want to hammer at that. Hey, it looks tight though. See the lines? Looks like it would withstand a few hits from the hammer. Maybe that's what these guys are doing. Look, now these pieces. There were some people here yesterday. I can tell it's just a mixture. Maybe that was kind of cool. That's why I was going to prospect a little farther out so we weren't like right down where everyone else has been, but whatever. I also have a knack for finding things that maybe other people don't find anyway, so don't worry about it too much, but knick-knack. Nicky, nicky, knack. So yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm going to bump up and try and bump up my... Oh, this is pretty... Definitely gonna try and bump up my uh, Etsy shop tonight. I usually cannot sit still. It's very hard to sit still. Have that problem. This is even prettier. How did I miss that? Um, I'm gonna try. What's that, honey? You're having some good candies? I bribed them with candies, of course. That's all it is now. I've got a box of bribery at home from the trick or treating. Straight up bribery box. Oh yeah? Yeah, so if you guys are interested in anything cool that you might have seen on my channel, give me a shout. <coughs> Um, it's apple bubblegum flavor. What am I on the hunt for today? I'm looking for pieces of my... Oh. Look at that. I'm looking for pieces of my... Quartz rock. See, there was a big, huge quartz rock farther up the valley in one of my previous videos and I couldn't get it home and then the water came and swooped it all away so now that's what I'm up to okay thank you I love these filled with crystals in there but I also love these oh dude 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 I've been wondering if I could carve out of these, right? I mean, these are so pretty. They make really cool magnets. This is really pretty, though. This is the most pretty. The most, the most, the most. But, anyway, so I'm going to scope along here, see if there's anything good. I'm not sure how high the water came up here. I'm not sure. We'll make a pile. Make a pile of interesting looking things anyways. This is a, ooh. I could hammer that. See what's in there. Got me chewing on my face. These are cool. A lot of minerals in a subduction zone. A lot of minerals. I might uh I'm gonna start doing lives again and maybe we'll just like sit down with some books that I've got and just be like 
hammer it in about the minerals that are in the subduction zones because we are definitely in a very cool... Look at this one over here. Yeah, you want to check out the sand? Go for it. Sand sounds safe. Sounds like a good time. All about safety here on Mad Dog Mountain Arts. Well, when Wolf's with me, when Wolf's not with me, I wouldn't say that you catch me doing the safest things around. This is neat, though. I don't know if the water came... Well, yeah, it did, actually. The water eddied here, so I'm kind of interested in to see what we're going to find. Chloride. Chloride. It'd be cool if I could find a nice piece of jasper. So anyways, hope you guys are having a good day. We're heading into November. Ba bam I'm gonna go work at the daycare. I'm sell my soul for money. You know? That's what we like to do. Well, actually, nobody likes to sell their soul for money, but that's, that's what life's about, isn't it? Isn't it? I've had quite the year. Quite the year, so. Gonna be excited to say goodbye to this year. <laughs> and maybe be and next year is going to be better. I asked my sister-in-law if she would, well, no, she's still my sister-in-law. Read my tarot cards for me, so I'm hoping that Maybe they got something interesting to say. I can't read my tarot cards anymore. I read them so many times, they're not even making sense anymore. So, oh, and when we're out of town, I stopped in two different places looking for kyanite deposits. And I probably have got some videos where I got you guys, like, ramped up about that. Kyanite's that blue, um, amphibable, amphibable crystal. Um, but both spots I stopped are like, it's hard when you're out of town because everywhere is somebody's yard or something, right? So I couldn't, one spot was like up the hill and clearly marked off with like no trespassing and another spot was like right on the side of the road, both in uh, Armstrong. So if I ever get back to there, there's a spot called Victor Lake guys are close to there and you know anything about it but it looked like it had agates and it had kyanite and it had uh, oh that's pretty is that a jasper agates kyanite gold i think i don't know look on the min file it was like a treasure it was some place I really want to go, but it was like 16 kilometers past like shoe swap or something like that. And we just weren't doing that that day because we were on the way to just like get somewhere. So there wasn't any more camping going on, but definitely that would be one of the spots that I would want to check out. Okay, I think I've yacked you guys' ears off enough, but at least I gave you some helpful hints. If you're in the Armstrong Shoe Shop area, go to Victor Lake. Go to Victor Lake. And look for some kyanite. Look at the sand over here. Cool. Okay, I'm going to stop this one. And I might do another one just because I'm here, but I'm going to go home. Then we're going to go home. And then what? I don't know. I don't know. Carry my rocks home. It makes me tough. It makes me very tough. Okay, peace it out. Oh, dude. Dude, 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 dude. Dude, did you guys see that? That's like a granulite. Metamorphosized quartz piece. We should bang that off, hey? I know what it'll look like though, sugary. Okay, okay, out.